Stream of Thought beer review here. Today we're looking at Bent Paddle Brewing Company. Mm. They're up in Duluth. This is their Three Wolf Funk from the Brett Saison. It's a collaboration with Dangerous Man Brewing and Modest Brewing. It's supposed to be a good one. We actually got the last one there. So really excited about this. Madison, you want to take us away? As is tradition. As is tradition. All right, boys. Wish Ooh. me luck. Good luck. All right, so I was looking up uh, some facts about this beer because they said it was supposed to be really, really good. Um, just by the smell, it's very fruity. You can smell the fruitiness of it, which is common with, it's a farmhouse style. It's supposed to be kind of fruity, kind of spicy, and very carbonated. Um, cool thing about this beer is that it was aged for seven months with two neutral oak wine barrels. Each one had its own like specific blend of yeast and then those two barrels were combined together. Mm. Really cool process. Um, supposed to be really good. Let's give it a go. Cheers it up. Cheers. Cheers it up. Cheers. 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 It's really tasty. I am really picking up the hints of the the fruitiness. Yeah. It's reminding me of a cider. That's what I was like. Good. That's what I got right away. Yeah. Cider. I was like, wow. And specifically like like a lighter cider, like yeah. semi-sweet cider. Yeah, it's not it's yeah. not super strong sweet. It's more like you can taste the fruitiness without too much sweetness with it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's really good. It, it is highly carbonated. Yeah. I did notice that right away. Mm -hmm. Really good. I like this. And when I say cider, I don't mean like apple-y. It's like mm -mm. just along that same it's line. It's like crisp. It's more, yeah, it has that crispness, mm -hmm. but I'm, I'm tasting more like grapey. Really smooth. Super smooth. So they they uh, they drink this type of beer more than water. Yeah, is that what you're saying? Farmhouse breweries. I was looking it up. Uh, back in the day in Europe, would they would all use their own grain to make uh, their beer? And yeah. bigger farmhouses that had enough grain would actually have beer every single day, and it was actually safer to drink their beer than That's it was nuts. to drink water. So what are we thinking for ratings on this boy? I'm thinking a five out of five. Five out of five? Any reasoning? Um, it was really smooth on the palate. Uh, it was exactly how Connery described it would be. Fruity, um, smooth, kind of had that pale ale aftertaste. I'm a big fan of Modest and Bent Paddle. You know, when we went up there, I tried their lemonade cream ale. That was good as well. Mm -hmm. I've never had, what was the other one, Dangerous Man? Yeah, Dangerous Man. I haven't had I've them never had them. I've never even heard of them. I'm very yes. impressed with this collaboration. Yeah. I yes. say five out of five. I'm, yeah, I'm going to agree five out of five. This collaboration is really nice. I like this like kind of hint of fruitiness and everything. It's not too strong to where it takes away from like the beer style pale ale and all that. Uh, it's overall a really nice beer to drink. I, I would have to say five out of five as well. I mean... Wow. For the first. Yeah, that, it, is, <laughs> it is a first. For Stream of Thought Beer Reviews, that's the first cross board 5 out of 5. Yeah. But I, it's kind of like a more fancier beer it tastes like. Yeah. It's like... Classy. Yeah, it's classy. <laughs> it tastes classy. classy. And even even the bent, yeah. bent paddle glasses. Oh. Yeah. Nice and, and classy. kind of like a chalice. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Pretty cool. Oh, fancy stuff. We love you, Ben Paddle. We love you. Modest love Brewing. You. Modest. Dangerous Man. Dangerous Man. You guys all came together. Yeah, we did it again. Yeah. Did it again.